Welcome back. Make sure you use always every day <laughs> of your life. Always use always. I think that's a curse when you ask someone to use it, 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 always every day of their life. I didn't say you, anything has to come out for you to use always. Just <laughs> use it just because yes. it's that good. Isn't that right, ladies? Of yeah. course. Yeah. Yes. All right. <laughs> so we have a very special guest in the house. This is his first time on any station on WeTV. Cool TV, <laughs> Wazobia TV. TV. He's Nigeria Info TV. He's right here Why in the building with us. Info Sorry, TV. correspondent. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for DJ Exclusive. <laughs> Another really famous quote by you that a lot of people love is Give Ambele. <laughs> what exactly does that mean? Um, Give we take Ambele this video. is um, it's just a street slang for saying increase the volume. So oh. give Ambele, give that to Ambele, give Ambele, give Ambele. So, so it's it, a street you're slang. not the origin, it, it didn't come from you? No, it's just a street so, word. So you know, I have to confess that the first time I actually saw yeah. you say that on TV, I was like, huh? Did you yeah. exclusive? Oh, we were all shocked. Say, we all yeah. saw it on, yeah. Like, yeah. on TV. I'm like, huh? And Kel was trying to explain to us that this was, oh, how come Kel was the only one who knew what give Ambele? Uh, maybe she's a I, rapper. Who knows whether she's been on the streets, I don't know. But it could also be because she raps as well. Mm -hmm. But it's a, I'm surprised you haven't heard it. It's a slang where loads of people say, you know, it's a street word. Just give Ambele, but give that your radio belly. Oh. So just increase the volume. Was saying, Give that radio <laughs> bell. Uh -huh. so I know you have a show coming on, but that's, yeah. that's, you're going to talk about that. Yeah, we, we must talk yeah. about yeah, that. Yeah, let's right? quickly check this video out. <laughs> oh, have a video. oh, no, go, go ahead. No, just according to Titi, hit me, hit me. I'm ready for you. That, you know, I, I researched for the blog, and then I asked several people <laughs> questions. Yeah. And I hear that you and Kel, even though she too, she's been dodging it, but I hear yeah. there, was, there was something somewhere. Which Kel? Kel uh, online, like Kel. Kel on, Kel on. Okay. Kel online, yes. Kel, Kel really? And this was yeah. when you were not in Nigeria. Okay, no. Kel and I never had anything. That's the question mm. you're asking. Uh, mm. Kel and I were very, very cool friends via Skype. Because when I was in London, uh, I met her while I was in London. Then she was in Nige with that, wow, wow, all right, if I'm right, mm. yeah. blowing up. Now, I was doing, I was in University of Reading doing events, and I wanted her to come to London or England to come and perform. Mm. So, Why in particular? Mm, There's mm. so many women who are yeah. doing exploits, in quotes, in music. She was actually really hard. Very hard. Um, because I happened to meet her through somebody. Okay. So someone introduced me to her. It's not like I woke up and I said I wanted to meet her. Uh, someone introduced me. This is even when Twitter starts, first started even. So someone introduced me to her. And uh, I was like, OK, I know this person. She's a celebrity. Maybe I can try and bring her to London. Okay, but I have to ask, you know how, oh, you know how about Will Clinton? Can we see the video? Bill Clinton. Can we see the video? No, can we, can no. we see the video? No, 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 no there's a video. There's no video. There's no video. <laughs> <laughs> Gloria, please, can you leave Wait, wait, wait I just have to say this. All right. There's no video. <laughs> <laughs> when Bill Clinton said, I don't know that woman. Um, yeah. Monica Lewinsky. Yeah. I never yeah. had any You know the face he had? Yeah. That's, That's the face I'm seeing here. Oh, really? Proceed. Uh, the good thing is um, Bill was white and I'm black, so I really oh. don't know what you're seeing, girl. <laughs> wow. You, know? you can never read a black man's face. Mm, Even your never. husband can lie to you. No, no but I'm I must say you were breathing a bit heavier when you said speaking about nah. it. Yeah. If you had a lie Bring your detector. lie detector. If we had a lie detector, I'd be like, <laughs> nah, Kel and I were good. We're good. Um, good friends. Uh, nothing ever happened. It should have happened, though. That'd be nice, though. Mm. Definitely, it's a club banger. Yeah. You, know, you. you know what I like about you? You have a lot of you have a lot of class, and Thank you. and you have that international standard. You've actually made DJing very very lucrative. You've oh, made wow. it very attractive. Yeah. So shout out to you. I you're, actually you're watching. Totally... I'm loving it. No, keep it going. I, keep it going. Yeah, yeah, please. Oh, wow. Thank it's you. Actually, uh, washing. Well, it's I would never, I would never ever wash. But to me, it looks like washing. But to her, is is yeah. is a, is a, is a true. Uh, but to me, it's not. Because I remember the first time I actually saw his spin. I was like, well, he's where, where the know, He doesn't have the. He doesn't have that. That that bad guy. Yeah. He's just like. Even when he says give him, give him. <laughs> no, but I do think, and that's why I think why I agree with Gloria is that you brought that finesse to DJing. And you know, we asked um, someone before in terms of the fact that it wasn't a very lucrative industry. Mm. Many people would not want to say, oh, I want to grow up to be a DJ. But right. looking at you, yeah. it could actually be something they want to do. Right. So it's, you know, it's really nice that you bring that excellence yeah. to it. Thank and you. And we're it's looking nice. forward to what's going to happen this um, Saturday. Yeah, and speaking yeah. of which, I have to say that album, my favorite song, maybe because it's Olamide, Baby D. Ah, ah that's the jam right there. I have ah, to say, shout wow. out to. Thank you. Yeah, very. Thank you. Uh, but it's like every song after you do that one, it's like you keep tapping. It keeps, yeah. it keeps feeling like it's better. So are we gonna enjoy some of these performances on Saturday? Um, yeah, I mean we're gonna the people performing. Uh, strictly from the album. Okay. Um, yeah. So no, if if I didn't feature on the album, nah, 
It's just because it's all about me and the album. Okay. Uh, some of the performances or performers will be there, not all because of their busy schedule, but mm. most of them will. Um, Such as? Uh, Wiz will be there, Wizkid, mm. uh, Olamide, if you know. Yeah! <laughs> we have a show, we have a show. Uh, if you know who else again, Banky, Cynthia Morgan. Two-Face. Um, Two-Face, we're not sure, because I'm, um, he, they were telling me he's supposed to be in Kenya. Locking so somebody sure. up. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what is it? Locking yeah, someone? Locking yeah. someone up. Oh. We wish that was what you said, actually. Timaya should be there. Timaya is one of my closest friends, Aww. so he should be there, yeah. But it should be great. It's, it's not really about the artist, to be honest. It's more about me, the DJ, and celebrating other DJs, as well as giving back to fans that have supported me. So it's free entry. I mean, strictly by IV, free drinks, free entry. Everything is free on the night. So you're not making any money from Don't make any money. Oh, wow. Nah, nah, so please nah. say that again, because this is probably one of the few shows where you yeah. can, you know, you have free entry, um, free drinks, free entry. everything is free. But entry is strictly by IV, so you okay. need to have an ID, IV. Wow. Uh, the drinks are free. Every table is going to have a bottle. I need everyone tipsy. How about food? Uh, they're going to be small snacks. Yay! Just small. For Are everyone you? or just for the table? Um, I, I, do not, I, I need to find that out. I don't know. I okay, we're getting our own special. No, right. but is yes. it possible for you to say something that will make your fans connect with you as a person, not as a DJ? Um, well, all my fans know anytime I say it's football, anything can happen. They know mm -hmm. when I say it is me, they know it is I. It is you I. Know, they know when I say it's a superstar DJ, they know who I is. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, so you tell know? us a little bit about yourself. So okay. you moved back to Nigeria how many <laughs> years ago, and you know you got into the scene, but you, just, you didn't just start DJing here in Nigeria. You'd been DJing back in, yeah. in Britain. In the UK. Yeah. Exclusive was born in 2002. So Exclusive <laughs> is uh, 15... No, he's 2002. What? Well, this is 2015, right? Years. So he's 13 years With old. With a strong corporate background. Uh, yes. So okay. I worked, uh, I did my degrees. Uh, I was in uni, Reading, went to Brunel, uh, did financial computer, did physics and computer science. Yes, I had to be a nerd. Mm. Um, Let's say that slowly physics with computer, computer science. science. Wow. And then I did financial computing. And those um, have come handy in any way? Oh, yes, yes, very well, very, very well. Mm -hmm. uh, that's why I tell people that you need to go to school because yeah. I run my business. Uh, I do have my team, but because of education, mm -hmm. I also know what I'm doing. Yeah. Um, so uh, I started DJing there, and I was working at the same time. But I realized that I was making, in a week, I was making like 1,000 pounds in a week mm -hmm. from DJing. So I was charging, let's just say, 250, 300 pounds. Uh, I'll do loads of gigs. I'll make almost 1,000 pounds. In a month, I was making about 1,000 pounds working. So I did the oh. math, and I was like, ah, man, DJing is the way forward. Yeah. Now, the problem is when you don't have security with a DJ, with a, a, co a corporate job, you have security, which is mm -hmm. you have your contract, you're getting paid yeah, at the end of the month. month. DJing, you're not sure. Next week, the manager and I don't say we're packing up the club. Yeah. So that was the fear. But I had a dream. I said, I want to do this. I told my parents um, I quit my job. My parents were not happy. I'm not going to lie. Mm -hmm. They were very scared. My dad thought... Uh, somebody had sworn for me, like, I'm going to send your child abroad and yeah. you're coming to tell me you want to DJ. Are you all right? So that was a problem. Um, I gave them a business plan and it planned for my career as a DJ, where I wanted to go, da 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 I tried to hook up a job at Choice FM in London, BBC One Extra, mm -hmm. Kiss FM. It didn't come through. So I now called Cool FM mm -hmm. and uh, got the job at Cool FM. Moved back in 2011, so I've been there for four years. And um, the rest is history. Got signed to EME, got signed with Whiskey as the official EME's DJ. <laughs> and um, the rest is hey, I'm here now. Oh, yeah. great. And it's yeah. definitely been worth the coming back home. Yeah. Um, I have a yes. really found admiration for you. Yeah, exactly. Oh, really? Wow. Yeah, I mean, the guy is oh. packing. You know, it's, it's good. It's really good. <laughs> it's like, do we have time for one more question before we go? Um, about the show. Because we definitely need to... Oh, oh, about oh show. we don't have time. Oh, sorry, sorry. sorry. Hit me. I'll answer oh, quickly. Of course, it's just about your private life. Because okay. in terms of the fact that a lot of people want to know about you, yeah. you are, you're engaged, yeah. you know, why did you make that decision? Do you think you're ready to get married, particularly because you're in the entertainment industry? Um... I'm engaged because, first thing first, uh, I am uh, going to be 32 this year. Okay. So um, I, I, I think in the, in the industry, a lot of people are single. They don't want to get married. But like I said, the two sides. Exclusive is not engaged. Okay. Road to me, I like you guys engaged. Oh. The two sides of me. So Road to me is ready to get married. Mm -hmm. Road to me exclusive. is exclusive. Is here. I'm trying oh, sorry, to make my money. Sorry, did I hear uh, Road to me Alakija? Mm, yes, Alakija. Wow, you're just finding out. <laughs> okay. You didn't know. <laughs> wow, oh, 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 time yeah, flies when you're having fun. See, all those que kel questions. I'm sure you wish. See what I mean by <laughs> <it>. <laughs> a lot of people don't know a lot of things about yeah, me. Yeah, it's a I whole lot of interesting it. stuff. But we've come to the end of the show. Um, we're going to give our final words, and then maybe you can tell okay. us what's going to happen 
Saturday, what okay. to expect, how to come, and all that stuff. Ayo? All right, so I won't say anything so that I'll give him enough time to say what he has to Do say. Do I talk wow, too much? you said it all. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to dedicate our final words <laughs> yeah, to, to you. Know, I want you to, have, you know, to talk about your show on Saturday. Okay. Uh, the show Saturday at Landmark, uh, Landmark Oniru, um, Landmark Center Oniru, and the White Cafe kicks up at 5 p.m. Uh, if you guys want tickets, all you have to do is just ring this number, 0818. <laughs> Three zeros, four zeros. So that's zero eight one eight three zeros, four zeros. If you can't get through to that number, another number is zero eight zero two three three eight three nine seven nine. Zero eight zero two three three eight three nine seven nine. Hit that number up. You will get a ticket. It's not a prank. Just call up and say you want to go get a ticket for exclusive party. You will be there. Alternatively, these beautiful ladies will give you guys tickets. They will let oh. you know how we can give you guys tickets. Oh. And then your Instagram and uh, uh, Instagram. Uh, my handle is DJ Exclusive eighty three. Mm -hmm. uh, it's actually spelled D J X C L U S I V E eighty three. And on Twitter, it's the same thing. D J X C L U S I V E. Hit me up. Probably give you a ticket as well. Oh, talk yeah. about swag. Put <laughs> on dripping. Shout out to DJ Exclusive. We've had so much fun. We'll be here again tomorrow, same time, same station. Until then, holla. Ow! Blood, love, blah, blah, blah. Ah. blah, blah, blah. <laughs>